Every year, more than 35,000 people need a bone marrow transplant, and unfortunately, more than half can't find a match within their own family. Today, ABC6 health reporter Susan Burton visited a local hospital whose goal is to add people to the national bone marrow donor list. Susan? The Yolanda Riverside Methodist Hospital is sponsoring a bone marrow donor drive today until 8. The drive is open to anyone age 18 to 60 who's in good health and has a giving heart. Chris Richardson was diagnosed with acute lymphoblastic leukemia. He was in need of a bone marrow transplant, but his family was not a match. He turned to the National Bone Marrow Transplant List. It looked like blood, like, like when you donate blood or, or receive blood. And the transplant itself only took about 20 minutes. Bone marrow transplants are used for certain diseases. The most common diseases are leukemia, myeloma, and lymphoma. But there are some rare diseases that we also uh, recommend the therapy for. Dr. Corliss explains it's not harmful to the donor. Well, the bone marrow um, will replenish itself and your body makes more white blood cells after the procedure is over with. You need to go through a simple screening process. And then we just have a quick health screening form to make sure that you don't have um, some of the major Ill illnesses like cardiac disease, um, kidney disease, liver disease, and then also a consent form. And then the procedure to get you to type you is actually very easy. It's just four, four Q-tips. Um, it's not a blood draw. It's not getting your bone marrow out of your bone. It's four Q-tips. Rita Pandy knew she wanted to be a donor. And there's a uh, shortage of minorities, so I thought I should. For Rick Palumbo, his reasons were clear. I just hopefully maybe save a life, I don't know, just maybe extend a life, just better quality of life, I don't know. Chris had a chance to thank his donor through letters. She's expressed in her letters that you know, she would like to meet me and you know, I would like to meet her. What does his donor's gift mean to Chris? It means, it means quite a lot because it, if she hadn't, I might not be sitting here. Again, the bone marrow drive is today until 8 at Riverside Methodist Hospital. If you'd like to donate and can't make it, you can call 614-566-5422. I'm Susan Burton, ABC6 on your side.